Welcome back everyone, thank you very much for joining me for our long awaited Lord's Mobile video and we are bringing back the Griffin Trap. So I'm turning the Trez main account into a Griffin Trap, I've lost a load of T2 and I have recorded it all so we're going to see how it went down. So this is the scout of the main Trez account. I have hit a two times false info, but this is what we were seeing. I did port to a, a, a relatively newbie kingdom, and I should have known that they weren't quite brave enough to take that on. Even though there's no T4, it's pretty much all T2. So I was getting a bit frustrated that this guild had found me, so I decided to port in, migrate over on the mini lead quickly in between WoW, you know. Just uh, doing my thing and just quickly come over and solo the main account to see if I can do it really because it's 14.6 million troops I believe. So I go range into cav foul. The, the guild that have found the account are just watching this like what what is even going on. And so I burn it once and then just pull it out just, just for science just to see if I could. I didn't really want to zero it myself. I was actually interested to see... If I hid my T4, let them zero the T2, and then Griffin trap them afterwards, just as a little bite back, but this guild were looking too newbie, the guy that ended up setting a rally on me needed to get capped, so we went ahead and did that, but, so the mini lead can indeed solo 14.6 million troops, I ported away, acted innocent, logged into the account I just burnt, and sure enough these little nooblets had set a rally, so I'm not going to let these nooblets take away the T2, we're not losing the T2 on this one. Hit the Griffin Trap, swap into attack gear. I'm already in infantry foul because I was in cav foul. And uh, yeah, they sent a range rally and safe to say that it didn't go very well for them. But props for them to try and for trying, honestly. it's uh, He was a really, really weak rally lead. I'm not sure I even look at the gear. But 301k reds, 1.8 million loss on my side and to be fair to them they did actually fill the rally almost sort of and a little sprinkle of t5 as well but it's a small comp and i'm just gonna turn it into a griffin trap comp and i gave i gave lho a beautiful little snack um a beautiful little snack later on in this video so moving on this guy actually attacked me and showed me that he was in infantry formation he was part of the guild that got Griffin Trap. I still had the mini lead in this kingdom. So quickly, I thought, just because he's given me his formation, he's 430 mil. I'm not going to scout him. I am just going to go in with a cab solo. And that is what your boy Char Char does. So speeding in with the cab solo now. And to my surprise, he actually burns. I was hyping with a 20.2 million mic drop and over a million losses he didn't swap out of inf foul I've, he seems to have sheltered his leader or hiding it somewhere and yeah he's not having a very good time and remember he's actually the one that attacked me I tracked him on the griffin rally trap griffin future rally griffin trap thing and now he's getting zeroed so a really really cool target here to find a nice little snack just uh, in between soloing myself and making myself look a bit more juicy, then they actually rallied it, got capped, and then I end up zeroing one of their members with a nice 27 million mic drop in that one. So this was pretty cool, made me smile a little bit, and then I innocently went back to the Sea Kingdom, and we finished up well, and I think we won that as well, so it was all gravy baby, and this guy did end up getting zeroed, so tracking him from what will be the Griffin, and getting the job done and i do apologize i haven't been around a lot lately i will be getting back into it hopefully the getting the griffin back and stuff will be a little bit exciting just to see if people still fall for it and it's always fun thinking of different ways to try and make it work so i'm going to start doing that again as well as the mini lead stuff and jumping around in guilds probably go visit size matters soon and i'm in ec at the moment so we will be getting some good guild content as well is this guy not zero yet Yay, there it is, 423k, and there is no leader. I don't know where his leader was, but rest in peace, that guy. I wish him all the very best. He an absolute lemon for attacking me with that 250k, and that was his gear. He was 430 summon, but he was not safe. I was pretty surprised I didn't get cap capped on that one, but I was uh, pleasantly surprised, that's for sure, and getting some kills, so... A real, real tree and capping that rally as well, which I didn't really look at that much. But it was a noodle rally. The guy that rallied me was a, a really, really weak lead. So 
Moving on into the LHO Kingdom. Now, you probably know LHO, they don't need any introduction. They are actually a bunch of legends. I didn't target them, I just moved to a LH Kingdom, because back in my Griffin Trapping days, I had a lot of fun with the LH Guild, the big, just all of the big Chinese guilds that follow each other around and stuff. I had a lot of fun because once a few of them jump over, normally a few of them from different guilds jump over and then all of a sudden you've got six good different guilds farming you. Now that didn't happen in this case, I hid all the troops, I decided I'm actually going to lose all of my T2 here so I've got my leader in the shelter, I've hid my T4, I've got a load of resource and I lose it all in an 11.6 million bloodbath. What a beast of a hit that um, that is 10.9, basically 11 million reds. But the new Sanctuary, which I didn't even know about by the way, I was quite happy to lose all of this. And a beautiful hit, what an awesome cab set that is. Big shout out to uh, Kitty, I think it was. But yeah, I, I really didn't realise that the Sanctuary update was so overpowered. So they're all coming in with the infantry solos to get that last million T2 range or so. Kitty gets a bit confused and sets another rally because uh, I was showing a false info again so it did look like more troops than what it actually was. And here they come in with the solos and then they all pop a 50% army size boost and baby they get into it. Look at that we've got some T5 coming. Now again things did go wrong in this. It wasn't perfect. I wasn't the quickest. I'm trying to get back into it but it's beautiful to see Char Char on fire again getting ready to grip and trap all of these lovely lemons. So it's uh, it was really cool. I did tell the guild that I was in that I am a trap and I'm trying to do trap things but I didn't really tell them that I'm a griffin trap. So unfortunately I did get removed from the guild and I was hiding in garrisons and reinforcements. And uh, yeah, luckily these guys were a little bit slow to see that. I didn't really think it would matter because so many arrows anyway. And uh, the arrows aren't really coming back really quick yet, so they're not too concerned. The march has definitely slowed down. It was unfortunate, but you just got to stay calm. Carry on. It is what it is. And unfortunately for F1 Canis there at the bottom, I was sort of targeting him because he was sending... 375k pure t5 a lot of the time and uh, that makes char char's heart very happy so i'm watching his first march his second march i when it comes to crippling trapping i normally just pick someone that seems to be sending really nicely and try and get as many marches from that one person and then whoever else i get i get and the, the timing on this was a little bit unfortunate i probably should have waited a bit longer but with my troops walking home, I didn't want them to get even more anxious. So I just quickly applied to their guild because I feel like I'd be a great candidate, to be honest. I mean, good good times. I, I don't, I didn't really mean to click that, but what a joke. Using the last Griffin Core to speed the troops home, switching into attack gear. Now getting the leader out of the shelter, like I say, a little bit slow. Still relatively, relatively quick, to be fair. Not, not too bad. And porting away, it did give them a bit more of a chance to send some more marches getting free leaders from my my lovely LHO at Lemons and uh, yeah a really nice return back to Griffin Trap in I'm back baby that was a lot of fun but full respect to these guys I'm gonna shield straight away because one solo a couple of solos with countering my front line is not gonna be good I did switch to cavalry wedge as well and this is the lovely lemon 3.1 bill still so he won't be worried about it but he's losing 375k pure T5 on a few of these marches. There you go. There's that two, the two marches and everyone else getting involved as well. Some of them being smart, farming with T2, but for the most part, I did get them pretty good. Now, this is a pretty suicidal tactic because obviously I've lost a lot of T2, but actually I got... 8 million of my T2 saved um, from the new Sanctuary update because my Sanctuary was already full from soloing myself so it was really really interesting and this guy, uh, the Canis guy sorry, getting the leader in there as well that's really really cool I yeah, get David's leader, he didn't pop a 50% boost, god damn it David god damn it David but yeah, a really, really good Griffin Trap. That Canis guy did lose uh, six or seven marches, and it was really, really cool, along with a lot of other of them losing troops as well. 
but it's not uh, anything against the guild specifically. I just went to Kingdom 1 and thought that it was a cool place to refresh my Griffin Trapping roots and LHO with the first guild to come over and do it. And what a beautiful rally it was, led to some beautiful things. You can see the T5 losses there are real 256k reds on that one. And we've already seen a 375k before that, as well as 225k wounded with 25k reds i did drop their guild about 800 mil troop might or something maybe not quite that much but i tried to look at what the guild go down but it was it was a lot of fun and you can see there i got the three million troops from the divine providence uh, troops claim there and i've got 4.5 million left as well as having a million in the sanctuary from soloing myself uh, so that new update is really overpowered it will allow me to do this tactic again I can just heal up, get as many troops as possible, hide all of the T4, hit a false info, maybe get a few people over. Once they take out all the troops, I will then griffin trap them once they all get their guild over and start being greedy. So that's the plan. I hope you've enjoyed this one. I hope I get to make more of these videos. And uh, yeah, don't forget to hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you very soon.